Hi, my name is Christian Ritz. I'm I'm the first author of this book. And uh, a little bit about myself before we talk more about the book. I'm a applied statistician. I'm an associate professor at the University of Copenhagen, and I've been working with this area for 15 years and working in R for more than 20 years. And I think that's all. Jens? Yes. My name is Jens Dreibeck. I'm a professor of weed science. I am uh, an agronomist by training and uh, work with uh, weed science and analytical chemistry and try to control weed for the last 45 years. So, a little bit more about the book. So, it's a dose response analysis using R and it's really focusing on the use of R. So, we will have a lot of code. We'll have a lot of explanations, a lot of interpretation of the output. We don't care so much about the statistical, mathematical details behind. I mean, you can look them up somewhere else. We really emphasize that it's a book for practitioners. And if I should shortly describe what's in the book, well, we start out with uh, fairly simple models and then we progress towards more specialized models in one sense and also more complex models in another sense. So we first uh, deal with uh, continuous dose response data, move on to discrete uh, dose response data, which is maybe where it all started at one point. And then we talk about um, more, more sophisticated types of dose response analysis, which are seen in germination data. So that's event time dose response data. And then we will move on to uh, hierarchical models, so uh, dealing with uh, mixed effects dose response models. The basic is that herbicides kill plants. Some plants are weeds, we want to control them. The crops, we do not want to harm them. It is called selectivity. And this is what started the work on the dose response curve. Then I met Christian 20 years ago and he suggested that we made a program, no, a, a package in R on this subject. It is a subject which is very important now because everybody talked about poisonous poison, but poison ha is a question of concentration. And this is what this is all about. How to measure an effect of a compound. We know that all compounds are poisonous depending on the dose. And this is what this is all about.